Hello everyone and welcome to another Router Gods video. My name is Humphrey Chung. We're taking a look at the CSR 1000V. This is going to be a quick video, about two, two to three minutes tops. Just showing you what's possible with this thing. I'm running on an Asus Republic of Gamers G75 VW laptop, 16 gigs of RAM. It's Core i7, pretty beefy laptop. Got my task manager up and running right here. And VMware Workstation 10, pretty new. What I've done is I've run four instances of the CSR1000V and I've hooked them up in a square topology. Uh, pretty simple, uh, two interfaces each. And you can see here, I've got the four routers already booted up. I'm running very simple OSPF, nothing too fancy here. And if I ping the loop back of router three, I should get a response back, or maybe not. All right, show IP interface brief, just to show you all the commands work. All right, there we go. Okay, so works pretty nicely. Show version just to, just so you can see it's iOS XE. And uh, pretty nice, pretty nice for a good, uh, quick and easy, quick and dirty study lab. So you can see here that uh, while I was doing my commands, we get uh, a spike up to about 10% 10, 10 on the CPU. Nothing too major there. And at resting state, it's around yeah, three or four percent. Now I am using Camtasia to record this screen, so you could figure in an extra percent or two from that. Memory usage, not too bad. Four instances, I'm clocking in at 12.7 gigs used. Uh, if I really pushed it, I could probably fit in another instance for five, but that would be a little tight. Uh, each one of these CSR 1000 Vs uses 2.5 gigs of RAM by default. You see right there, 2.5 gigs. I have seen videos where people put that down to about two gigs. That might be pushing a little bit. I'd probably feel comfortable at 2.25 or 2.2. Uh, once I upgrade this laptop, this laptop that does have four slots for RAM. Uh, two, two are a pain to get to, they're under the keyboard, so I have to rip those out. But once I put in uh, eight gigs, eight gig slots, I'll have 32 gigs RAM and I'll be able to run many more instances but four instances on a 16 gig Core i7 runs just fine as long as you have SSDs and it's it's not too bad. All right, so in a future video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do this, how to set up your virtual networks inside of Workstation, how to download it and how to install this guy uh, the correct way. Thanks for watching.